I'm going to be reading you a story called The Magic Hat by a beautiful Australian author, Mem Fox. The Magic Hat. One fine day from out of town and without any warning at all, there appeared a magic hat. Oh, the magic hat, the magic hat. It moved like this, it moved like that. It spun through the air and over a road and sat on the head of a warty old toad. Oh, the magic hat, the magic hat. It moved like this, it moved like that. It spun through the air like a bouncing balloon and sat on the head of a hairy baboon. Oh, the magic hat, the magic hat. It moved like this, it moved like that. It spun through the air from way over there and sat on the head of a sleepy old bear. Oh, the magic hat, the magic hat. It moved like this, it moved like that. It spun through the air. It's true, it's true. And sat on the head of a kangaroo. Oh, the magic hat, the magic hat. It moved like this, it moved like that. It spun through the air for a mile and a half and sat on the head of a lofty giraffe. And then with a skip and then with a hop, a wizard appeared with a sign that said, Stop! So everyone stopped and stared in surprise at the wonderful wizard with sparkling eyes, who took from his beard with a nod and a wink, a wand which he waved, and what do you think? The toad, the baboon, the bear and the roo, and of course the giraffe, oh what a to-do, turned back into people, dazed and confused, watched by a crowd that was highly amused. While no one was looking, the wizard meanwhile skipped out of town with a mischievous smile. And, of course, on his head was the fabulous hat that made all the magic wherever it sat. This is one of my favourite stories. I love it for the rhyming. And normally in a classroom I'd love to do so many fun activities with you, um, but we'll have to wait until we get back from home learning for that. Hope you enjoyed it. Thank you.